Hey you guys, uh, Lacey and Steve from Duo Reacts. Steve and Lacey. Thank you so much for coming to our channel and watching The Walking Dead with us. We are finally on season three. Episode one. Seed. Seed. So, yeah, so um, I know that we are filming this before um, our live stream, our live stream, but of course, the live stream will be on Wednesday, so if you want to see, you know, any of our discussion about Season 2, about, you know, like our predictions for Season 3, all of that, go back to that video, to that live stream, so that you can, you know, see our thoughts on that. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, I Season 3 is going to be an interesting one, I think, so... Yeah, I think so, too. And everything that I've read in the comments says that the action really begins... It picks up. Picks up. Yeah. So, and I can't imagine that because everything that I've watched so far through season one, season two has been nothing but great. Right. So, so it's like it's going to pick up. Like, wow. Okay. And uh, <laughs> someone sent me this shirt. It's a Viking shirt, which uh, we're going to be doing, uh, hitting that again. Uh, hopefully this week we'll be doing some videos on that so pay attention for that uh i wanted to wear it because i don't know who sent it to me but um, well, i can't remember off the top of my head but i want to thank you, you know very much you <laughs> i wore it a couple times and i love the shirt so yeah, thank you awesome. so damn much for that so um i love t-shirts man they're freaking awesome so um yeah okay yeah um and you have some questions for us, do you? I do, I do. And I'm going to pull them off my phone here. I told some people that we'd discuss some of their uh, uh, thoughts and questions for us right now. So we're going to start with Dreadhead. Question, <laughs> do you think after seeing what happened to Dale, could you be uh, taken down by one walker? Me, personally, can't see it happening to me. Love your reactions. Keep it up. So first off, thank you so much, Dreadhead love your uh your comments and questions and please keep them coming so to answer your question i'm gonna start off okay um no you don't think one absolutely one not. walker could take you hell down. no no i don't see that for a minute hell for no. you anyway no like for me yeah one walker could take me down no i will bludgeon that thing <laughs> So, yeah, with that being said, no. Uh, one Dale, one he was, walker could take me down, though. Like, I'm pretty small. I'm a tiny person. Well, I think person, once you've seen you know, other people doing yeah. it, you would catch on to what I, needs yeah, to be done. I and, think after a while of, like, you know, practice and all that, like, I would... I, I am a very fast learner. So yeah. I would catch on to things really quick and... Like, I would uh, get it down uh, and I would make her... Uh, slice away at it to practice, right, but right. yeah, that would probably be how I would get her up to speed, and you know, she would develop. I would develop over instinct. time, but so, if I was left to my own devices early on, I would probably struggle because. But that's why we're here. That's why we have the apocalyptic yeah. apocalyptic team uh, yeah. to kind of show everybody how to do things. Yeah. So um, you know, haven't really shown her. Uh, I told her how to kind of defend herself, you know, in other cases and whatnot. But um, in this case, you know, in when you're dealing case, with... In this case, I don't think those pointers would really help too no, much. No, not really. But... Not really. Yeah, I mean, I'd, I think I would catch on after a while. And after a while, I don't think one walker could take me down. Because I wouldn't let it get close enough to take me down. Right, right. But initially... You can move I, when you need yeah, to. Exactly. Yeah. And that's the good thing. I You're can, more of a Glenish. I uh, yeah, I'm pretty agile when I want to be. Yeah. <laughs> you know, so yeah. I I think I could uh, steer clear of zombies or walkers long enough to build up strength and build up yeah. knowledge and you know all yeah. of the above. So. And you know, me personally, no. There's no way. Yeah, there's no way. I know exactly he, what I would do. He's a tough guy. He would not be able... I mean, I've seen... A group now are coming take, at me. take down, like, big guys. <laughs> <laughs> not not in a violent way, just like... You know what I mean. Well, 
it wouldn't happen. Not like you were these. fighting them, but you know, like yeah, but, but yeah. Anyway, make a long story short, absolutely not. And that was a good question. Um, kind of wanted to see where Lacey would go with that. Um, I haven't. I yeah. I don't know what questions he picked, by the way. So no, I'm throwing this at her right as we go. Yep. Gravity prone part two. Uh, awesome reaction, uh, guys. Did you ever expect this end for Shane? Rick is just so broken over having to kill his best friend. Good thing Daryl will be the guy going forward. Love the Herschel Glenn moment. Uh, I like Glenn. I like Glenn. So, same with me, uh, Gravity Prone. I love, once again, your questions and comments. Love them. I love reading right, them. Yeah. In fact, everybody, I, I love their comments. I've, I've read all of them. Uh, most of them I try and answer back. Uh, sometimes we get caught up in doing things. Yeah. But um, we try to read as many as we possibly can. You yeah. Know. And thanks, everybody, for the wonderful comments for Lacey doing her double upload, which uh, hopefully. Pretty much stayed up all night just to do that for you guys. Yes, so she it, did. It, it definitely meant a lot going through the comics comments and seeing you know all the love that you guys were showing for. Thank you so much. That. She deserved that, and that's all on her. Uh, no, no, I never thought that Rick would be the one to kill him. No. No. I didn't see. I, this I coming. didn't see that coming. I thought that it would be. I mean, I figured it would be him acting crazy, right? I did think in some be, way. I did think like, it would be Rick that that had to stand up to him because no one else in the group. Well, I yeah, think, but to actually other than Darryl, kill him, other than Daryl, right? You know, would stand up to Shane. Shane was, you know, I hated to see Shane go because oh, no, he I was, was happy to see him go. Well, he needed to go. Let me. He hear, was causing too many. But. They hear me out. He was going to end up getting people killed. He he did want people safe, and he was willing to do whatever it took. That's the reason I feel like losing someone like him, you know, was... But you're right, you're right. He was a big liability. When it, when it comes to Lori and Carl, like, yeah. they are priority to him. So if that meant putting everybody else that in danger is. to mm -hmm. keep them safe, he would. Now, Rick, I don't think he would do that. Like, yes, I think he would do everything in his power <clears throat> to keep Lori and Carl safe. But everybody but in he a would, too. Yes, he would not put somebody else in danger. Like, he would think a way through it. Shane wouldn't. He would just act. Yeah. That's the problem. And not process right. everything. Take a day like Rick yes. would. Yes, yes, exactly. That is the problem. But, yeah, um, I hope that answered that question. I thought it was something that we needed to talk about. And I said in the mm -hmm. comment that, you know, I think that's something that we'll bring up in the show. So, um, Trey McGrew, thanks for the double upload. <laughs> I really love your channel and the way you guys really think about and break down the shows you watch. Thank you. Uh, I do have one question. Seeing that The Walking Dead and Breaking Bad are both TV shows that aired on AMC. Love AMC, by the way. I wanted to know which one is your favorite so far. I know you guys are not that far in either show, but I still wanted to know where your heads are with both of them. Love you guys and keep up the great work. And thank you, Trey McGrew, uh, for that. So um, I thought that was a good question. Yeah, that is a good question um, because they, you know, they're both aired on AMC, which yes. is something that we didn't like. We have. didn't have. We still don't have it. I think at this point. We um, might now. We might. I don't know. Um, but we're watching these shows. You know, because we bought them, like, right. online. Yeah. So that's how we're watching them now. But, yeah, um, which one is better? Like, which one do I like more? Like, they're both very good. Yeah. I like them both for different reasons. They're there. Um, yeah. The Walking Dead, I'm just going to say, I would, seems yeah. more interesting to me to talk about. Right. Breaking Bad to is... To theorize about and to... 
Yeah, it creates yeah. more discussions, I think. For me. For me. And for me, too. Because, you know, I am a bit of a, you know, what would I do in this right. situation yes. type thing. Yes. Um, that time. That intrigues me in the conversations we have with The Walking Dead. Breaking Bad is more of a show that interests me because of the content. The well, content and the characters, yeah. which, of course, that is the same with The Walking Dead, just in a different way. Right. Um, like I said, I like them both so much for different reasons. Um, I would say the actual content of The Walking Dead interests me more than the actual content of Breaking Bad. But the way they're both put together is so great mm -hmm. and just so well done that it makes them both very appealing to me. Yeah. But in yeah. different ways. Yeah. yeah. So to pick a favorite. I don't know if I could pick my a favorite, favorite to talk at about the is The Walking Dead. Right. Breaking Bad interests me. Because it's such a damn good show. Yeah, and you're it's, you're always wanting to see what's going to happen next. Yeah, and like The Walking Dead, I, I picture all the characters, and all the characters fit in the place, and they really did a very good job at right. picking the, the actors for very, this. Very, very good I, I don't know how they did such a good job to put these players in play. Right. With uh, Breaking Bad. It's really just a couple characters <clears throat> that you are like invested in right right and i'm so, always now breaking bad's more of a thinking game like you know trying to figure out uh what's going on and how is this you know i mean it's it's it definitely has you thinking all the time yeah. well the walking dead it's it's kind of uh it, it's same but it puts you in the seat of if something went down and you feel part of the group more like you feel like yeah, you could put like yourself you feel like you're, into that, where yeah. I don't feel I could put myself into the the, yeah. the Breaking Bad show. But you're still invested in what's happening with the characters. Yeah. But it then, like I said, both great shows, both I like for their own separate reasons. And both I don't are, I don't think up. I could say at this point. I mean we're starting season three in the walking dead and we're uh a few episodes in to season three of breaking bad so we're very close in yeah. how deep into it we are exactly i would say with the break uh with breaking bad we've had more actual content because there's been more episodes i think or maybe yeah yeah i think i don't know i could be wrong on that I think there's, well, it feels like there's been more episodes. Like, it feels like we, yeah. and maybe that's because there's fewer characters. So there's fewer characters to get to know, so there, we're actually able to focus on the story more. And apparently we haven't even hit a lot of yeah, the characters with The Walking Dead. Yeah, and in The Walking, Walking Dead, Dead, there's more characters. Yeah. So, I mean, you have, yeah. you have people We have a in lot for, more to get to know. Yeah, like yeah. The, the people at the bar, you know, they kind of show up. Yeah. You, know, you don't get to know them, but... And, but the rest of their group could still out be there. out there, you right. know. So, yeah, there's a lot to think about going forward in The Walking Dead. Um, I did want to mention that uh, we haven't seen Morgan. I think we will. I mean... You haven't brought that up I, in a while, and I haven't either. I kind of forgot about him. I kind of forgot about him, but I was thinking about it, like when we were just thinking about different characters, like, he popped into my head, and I was like, whatever happened to him? Uh, are we ever going to see him again? I think so, because Rick, you uh, know, you know, it goes back to him trying to contact him via the CB or the radio, the handheld, mm -hmm. um, trying to reach out to him. So I always felt like that. I just, like, I just plain forgot about him until you said something just now. Seriously. Like, I had forgotten about him, too, up until That's literally a few up. minutes ago. Like, when we were talking, I literally, he went through my head when we were talking about characters. And yeah. I figured I'd bring it up since I'll probably forget about it again unless we see him at some point. But, yeah, I just wanted to bring that up that we haven't seen him. So Yeah, so Shane, um, the, the answer to that question, did I feel um yeah but with uh 
you know, Shane leaving the show, I didn't feel like his time. I want to go back to that for one okay. second. Okay. Um, I felt there was more that was going to happen with him. So his death really was like, whoa. Yeah. You know, yeah. I felt he was a pretty important character. And I didn't know where it was going. I thought maybe at some point he'd separate from the group and yeah, become. I, I, I was kind of hoping that he would not descend into such crazy and that he would be a more bigger part of the show because he was an, I mean, amazing actor. Amazing. Oh, yeah. Did an amazing yeah. job. Um, was Rubbing it, his head. Yeah. yeah. Psycho. <laughs> yeah. Um, um, but yeah, I, I was job. hoping that he would be a bigger character, but I mean, only made it to the end of season two. So he was someone that else? you loved to hate Yeah. or began to hate. And there's some people that really liked him and, you know, mm-hmm. a lot of people with different opinions on Shane. So that's something I'd I don't like. see. I don't have like, I don't, I don't hate his, Shane. Right. Like. I think that he allowed his, he allowed the crazy to happen, right? Like, he did not know how to deal in this world. He did not know how to keep his humanity. Overtook him. It overtook him. It could happen to anybody in a situation like that. Lori really... And she didn't help anything. No, she didn't. She, with the sending mixed signals... I don't think she... One minute she's in, one minute she's like the furthest away yeah, from him. Yeah, I don't... And but then, I don't, and then, and then I also, she goes back to him. You but know, I it, also don't think she meant to do that. No, but... Like, I don't think she meant to be sending mixed In his signals. eyes, man, when he walked away, you knew yeah. that, that... And that's what I'm saying. At at some point, even though you, you aren't meaning to do this, talking about Lori, you know... Shane, yeah. and you know how yes. volatile he is. She you knew know. that. She knew that. So at some point, thinking rationally in your head, shouldn't you be like, I should be really careful about what I say to him? And then her standoffishness to Rick after he that, did kill him was that like got a little me, bit weird too. That got me super confused too because she I, was that like her realizing something in that moment that maybe she did actually she caused this. Yeah, I know. Unbeknownst, I mean, with all the history, she really she led mean, to the demise yeah, of, of Shane. She didn't mean for things to happen that way, but ultimately it happened because of her. Yeah, like, Everything. Yeah, like before the incident led to the incident yeah. of him dying, Yeah, uh, Rick and him had went out. They were best friends. They, they still were. They talked about it. He yep. knew what was up. Rick was like, I understood, I understood, I understood. Yep. But Shane, you know, feels that Rick is ultimately going to let down Lori and Carl and get them killed. And he felt he was in no way, shape, or form going to be their protector. Yeah, right. Because he felt he was leading them into danger every time. And that might be true in, it might in have some been facets. True. It might have been true. And, and, yeah, but it wasn't his place anymore. It was mm-hmm. maybe for a few weeks or a few months, right. however long. It was his place at that time, but he couldn't let go. He could not let go. So I don't completely fault him for being crazy. But at the same time, I kind of do. <laughs> because, well, like, you can you have control over your own actions. Period. Some pe- some, I mean, with some everything going don't. down, I mean, uh-huh. and, you know, it happens. You know, he, love love <clears throat> and, and lust makes some people crazy and... You know, I mean, it happens. Yeah. It freaking happens. And Shane had a little bit of everything coming at him. Yeah. Did not know how to deal. He did not and know how to deal with it. It's best that he's gone from the show. Yep. Um, because it, it he, was done. he was only going to continue to descend. And, and what some, do you think about uh, Carl's first kill being Shane, Shane the Walker? Uh, yeah, that's a bit, that's Isn't crazy. That heavy? Yeah. The guy like, that protect- is that going to mess with his head? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe, maybe in a way, we'll have to see and pay attention. Right. But Carl, I mean, pulled the trigger, man. Yeah. He pulled the trigger on a big car. I mean, come yeah. on. That's kind of big. Yeah. That's kind very of big. Very big. Very big. 
But, um, but, but Trey, to your answer between Breaking Bad and The Walking Dead, Lacey, um, I, I don't know if she answered it no, right. No, I said, well, I like them both for their own reasons, and I don't know if I could pick one above Over the, the other. other at this point. That's what I was going yeah, at. Yeah, yeah. Me, I'm, I'm going to go with, uh, I, I think, The Walking Dead. Um, Has a Breaking Bad advantage. is great, man, is great. I, I wouldn't miss it for anything. Right. It's going to get done. It's going to be a show that we watch. Mm-hmm. Um, and for their own reason, I like it. But The Walking Dead, I'm going to pick above. Has a slight advantage. I enjoy talking about right, it. Right, because, it's, yeah. It's it's really something that I... Well, I, I could probably say the same thing, too, then. Yeah. That it might have a slight advantage just for the simple fact that the content yeah, is, is and it, ha- it they, they creates, pack so damn much creates in, such good discussions well they, yeah they pack so damn much into a 47 minute video yeah that it's like holy shit this goes on this goes i mean it, yeah. it's it's never a point where you can walk, turn your head away and be like oh like i'm sucks. getting i'm yeah it's like boring it's never boring like i've been super bored for like half this episode no that never happens i've had that on on some yeah on some shows, I you know I've been like, geez, or I. But yeah, we'll uh, we'll go ahead and get into the episode now. I'm really excited to get into season three. Yeah, me too. Me too. Yeah. <laughs> so. Uh, keep your questions coming. We love to talk about them. The more interesting. Uh, you may not think it's interesting, but it may be something like we're yeah we need to talk about that. Yeah. All right, let's do it. Let's get it on like Donkey Kong. I was just making sure it wasn't a recognizable face. Okay. I wonder if this is a time jump. Carl. Really? Okay. He's in the action here. It's got a silencer on the gun. Did you see that? Oh, maybe this is a slight time jump. I don't know what made you think that, but... Because he's in the action, like he knows what he's doing? Fucking uh. <laughs> Daryl. <laughs> Definitely a time jump. So we got Glenn, Maggie, T Dog, Carl, and Rick. And Daryl. And Daryl. Supper? Yep. <laughs> Clearing it out for everybody. There's Carol, Beth. Oh. Holy cow, yep. dime jump. See, okay. I had a feeling. Okay, she's like. Wow. Ooh, okay. Herschel with the. Beard and. He's been definitely out of his home for a while. Yeah. I wonder if they've just been like on the move. This That's exactly what I think. They cleared out a house for him to stay. Stay the night or stay. Or. Yeah. Hunk her down for a couple days or something. Right, right. Wow, they all look like... Rough. (laughs) Really rough. And beat. (laughs) He's like, we're not eating dog food? Those are like, they look very primitive right now, like. Yeah, they're not talking. Speak. Uh oh. Time to move. So they basically always have to be on the move. Is this probably like six months? Six months down the road based I would on say, the belly? I would say. <laughs> I found nothing to scavenge there, so maybe that's what they were doing. Was I think they were scavenging, yeah. 
Prison? Prison. What did I say? At the end I'm of the last video. Maybe the... You can't keep going house to house. You need to find some place to hold up for a few weeks. All right. Is it cool? <laughs> she's get getting close. Won't take long. We gotta fill up a lot. She can't take much more of this moving about. What else can we do? Let her get birth on it, right? You see a way around that? Hey. All the others wash their panties. Let's go on. Yeah, I can't imagine that there's too much meat on an owl. And it was small owl. I right. Thought. Oh, there's a watchtower. Sure. Oh, it's overrun. Yep. Look at his mind working. He says this is it. It might be safe place for. Well, it's meant to keep people out and pe pe keep people in. Right. Might be their only option. For Lori. What's the best thought? Okay, so now they're like in between, in between the two fences. And the fences are usually bunkered down with concrete. Right, so, so they're probably you'd have, to bend the, you'd have to bend the metal somehow. You know, that'd be the weakest point. Right. We can shut that gate. We're in more from Bill in the yard. We can pick up these walkers. We'll take the field by the night. So how do we shut the gate? I'll run for the gate. <laughs> okay. Pretty good at well, strategizing. To get them... Yeah. I'm surprised that was even unlocked to begin with. Maybe when... People were. I'm shocked. Usually, them are locked in because they usually rotate. Right. I don't think it's usually a slider. But it's... Oh. Carol. Uh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> My bad. Oh, I see what they're doing. Taking what they can. Plugging it out. Yeah, one area at a time. Okay. I don't think there's no getting through there. Now kill them all. They've all gotten very good at shooting in the head. <laughs> That's the gun you want. It's a lot of uh, noise, though, too. Yeah, it is. Looks like there's plenty of space to have like farm, a garden, and like. Well, now they, if they can set it up right, this would be good. Right. Yeah, I was gonna. I'm like, are they going to like move inside at some point? Oh, or? I would think. Find a way in. One step at a time, though, right? That's his third time around. If there was any part of it compromised, he'd have found it by now. <laughs> He's double, triple checking. Probably a good idea. This will be a good place to have the baby. Swamp. A rifle for kickback? I'm just not used to it. He's, Mr. Like, he's got Mr. Mir Mr. Miyagi here. He's like, here, I'll, I'll work it out there. Aww. They, these two really Very care about life. each other, you can tell. I'm not getting like a romantic oh, vibe, though. More she just said that. Really? That's weird. I was just thinking that. See, they laughed at it, though. I don't know, like a brother-sister vibe or like a... I don't know. It's brother-sister. She wanted to screw around. Yeah, but they... Yeah, I got it. You know, Nate. Oh, of all the money Here I have I spent it in good company has a really pretty voice. Mm -hmm. I like Beautiful. it. Beautiful. And for all we've been through, we can handle it. I know it. Well, they cleared that area yeah, pretty easily. <laughs> the baby is about to be 
terms are mm, they no like a formation like all like back to back like in a circle it's probably a good idea okay Damn. you guys uh, they've been doing this for a while oh is right chill Nice to have their stuff. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, shit. Well, they, I mean, they can't bite through that either, so. You have to get the helmet off. Go up through here. They can't really bite if they have them. That's what I'm saying. They're what, and they have gloves <clears throat> on. Close, close it, close it. Yeah. That's a lot. There you go. Yeah. Oh. oh. That was nasty. Oh. That was nasty. But yeah, take that equipment. I would. <laughs> For sure. I mean, maybe not the one that has the face stuck on to it. Clean it. Yeah, right? Ooh, and um, it's going to be dark in there. Yeah. Oh, that looks pretty were, empty. It was that easy to get in there. Right? That's definitely a city gap. Oh, like a, like a lunch room? Area. or Yeah, a common area. With the... Yep. When I worked in the prison, that's kind of what they had. Things you could look at on them. It's like. Oh, that is definitely gone. Yeah. Keys. Yes. That's what I was yes. thinking. Yes. I'm sure you're going to need those if this is like an older those, prison. Those, yep. What do you think? Home sweet home. <laughs> the time being. It's secure. The cell block is. In the morning, we'll find a cafeteria and infirmary. You found your cell yet? Uh, yeah, I was just, um, just making sure that's safe. Uh, uh, yeah. Aw, does Carl have a little crush on Beth? Oh, wait. The armless. Yeah. This is the mystery person. Does that sure mean is. does that mean Andrea <clears throat> is here? What you doing out here? Please what? Oh no. Is she not doing good? No. You should go in a few days. I wonder what's wrong with her. They're coming. You should go. No. I'll hold you back. Go. I can take care of myself. I saved your ass all winter, didn't I? We'll go in a few days. I mean, she's going out and trying to find aspirin for her and stuff, so Who's they must have grown pretty close. Yeah, she's been with her all winter. Okay. And she won't leave her. Oh, 
What's the reasoning behind that? That's what I'm like. Oh, they don't have jaws either. Yeah, I saw that. No jaws and no arms means they're they can't hurt you. But why would you be dragging them around? Carry your stuff. No. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Might as well make them. They don't seem like they're like attacking or anything. That's where they're not going for. Yeah. That's weird. That's the baby. I think I lost it. You haven't felt it move. Nothing. At first, I thought it was exhaustion. Oh my gosh. You're amazing. What if the baby dies inside of it? Would it turn? Would it be a zombie baby? Yeah. What if it's dead inside me right now? What if it rips me apart? Stop. She was thinking the same thing I was thinking. That's not going to happen. I never made it all the farm. Yeah, I lost it. Yeah. Hormones. Some kids, Tammy. Hormones. I think she's also feeling like nobody wants her around and she's all causing all this trouble for everybody. And you know who doesn't get a shit about that? This baby. <laughs> now let's make sure everything's alright. Oh, are they going on their exploration? Check out the rest of the prison. Yep. <clears throat> Gonna get dirty. Ooh, and it's dark. Scary. Yeah, I would Very hate that. Very scary. And then with just flashlights too. Oh. Yeah, I would hate that. That is creepy as shit. There you go. Make sure you know your way back. I'd be on edge too. Oh yeah. Imagine how bad it stinks in there. Being all closed up like that. I bet they're used to it now though. That's rotting, nasty smell. <laughs> It's like around every corner you're expecting to... It's like the greatest haunted house ever. Right? bodies. Oh no. Are they gonna get lost? Wow. Oh my gosh, they're separated now. Yep. <clears throat> Stuck in a closet or something. Stuck somewhere in a, a little room. Where'd all the walkers go? There was just a shit ton of them. Yeah, I know. I don't like that. Yeah. No! Oh. No! Oh. <gasps> oh my god, no! Are you serious in the first episode? <sighs> Are you freaking kidding me? They're gonna, they're gonna kill Herschel off in the first frickin' episode. Jesus. God damn it. Oh my gosh. Hold him down. Is he gonna cut his leg off? I am tourniquet. Yeah, that's what I, he, I saw him taking his belt off. Is that gonna work? Jesus Christ! Mm. Oh my God! Is he passed out? Yes, oh, thank he God! Is. Jeez. Oh. 
Have they had to do this before? Do they know if it works or is he just hoping and praying? We now. <gasps> what the fuck is this? Oh my gosh, are, are they alive? Yeah, they're alive. Oh my freaking Jesus. Oh my God, it's over. What the hell? They make the climatic end and <gasps> we're done. Oh my gosh, that was a lot to take in the last like literally 60 seconds. Yeah. For two minutes. If so that. maybe, maybe <clears throat> not. Herschel could be okay. It's 50 50. I mean, I don't, maybe they've had to do this before. I don't know. Or maybe it's just hoping and praying. Or he said he's bleeding out, so there might be <sighs> that too. And then we have alive prisoners hiding out. Yeah. And they're prisoners. <sighs> so immediately you have to worry about are you going, are they going to kill them? Are they going to let them live? Are they going to, like, no, you, they're prisoners, but then again, you can't always judge a book by its cover, you know, but they're prisoners. Like, they're just as shocked. They seemed pretty they're shocked. alive, somehow, and surviving. And it's been, like, what, like a year? Almost a year? So, they've been there for a while. Yeah. So, which, apparently, wherever they're at is safe. Uh, at least on that, wherever they're at. Like, that cell block. Well, yeah, wherever they were at, like, it's, maybe they just kept that door closed up or something. I don't know. Uh, I don't know where they're at, but obviously they got food there. Well, right now, they have zombies so, outside that yeah, door. exactly. Oh, my gosh. And Ugh, Herschel. Excuse me. Herschel is bleeding out. We're hoping that by cutting his leg off in time maybe that will prevent the spread maybe we're gonna find out but it doesn't look good it doesn't look good so he, he might die anyway so i i don't even know my brain <laughs> it's going so fast right now like in circles as what to think i guess but boy rick really took action though and cut it off did. quick that was real quick thinking like, but depending on... But I, I just don't know if this is something they've had to do before, so he knows, or if it's like, I'm going to try and do everything I can when to when save When your heart's, you. you know, after you got bit and He's, everything, I wonder if it the has a his system exactly. somehow. Exactly. That's why I'm like... Because it had to at least have been like a couple minutes. or It's well enough to get it through your system. Exactly. Maybe not me. No, but still. Wow. Man, that's great. Great episode, though, I you guys. It's called Seed. Yeah, Seed. Hmm. I don't know. If you guys know why it was named Seed, let us know in the comment bo bo comments below. Um, Did we miss something? I, yeah, am I missing something? Like Maybe during editing. Planted we'll a seed? Yeah. What's the next one called? Sick. Well, we know Andrea <clears throat> appears to be sick. Yeah. So, is it something... To do with her? Yeah, maybe. But, great episode, you guys. Um, we're going to go ahead and end it here because that was a lot to take in. I need to think about things. We'll yeah. discuss it at the beginning of the next video. Yes. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave a like on this video. Yes comments and questions below please do make love sure, the comments yes, and questions yes make sure you subscribe if you're not already and share the video share the video and bang that bell make sure you go over to our patreon page and check that out that out if you're interested in full reactions early access and speaking to us on discord yes and we hope that you guys have an amazing and awesome day. Hope amazing happens to you. Peace out.